Uh, by the way, wait, I think I still have one circuit here. So, I'd like to just um, show you this DC bias with voltage feedback. So, if you're going to look at the given circuit, okay, meron tayong, again, this is a complete amplifier circuit. Meron kang input doon, V in, at saka yung V out. Okay? So, hindi lang to yung DC circuit. Now, uh, baka malito kayo, okay? So, meron siyang capacitor doon. May capacitor siya doon. But since ang capacitor, again, in a DC analysis, ay open, then this will actually reduce our circuit pag DC circuit na lang siya, mawawala lahat itong capacitors na to. So, yan. So, nung gagawin nyo dyan. Now, if we are going to put on the current, uh, I'll just show you yung, yung isang KVL equation for this circuit. So, ito yung IC natin. This is our IC. And then, of course, ito yung IB natin. And then, this one, this is our IE. So, if we are going to to uh, come up with our KVL equation, saan tayo dadaan? So, dito tayo dadaan. So, we we'll start from here and then paganon and then downwards. Okay? So, let me just show you yung KVL equation for that. So, we'll start at 30. So, it will be 30. And then, we have minus... 6.2 kilo ohm IC and then we have so ano yung current flowing through these resistors in series 220 and 470 so ang dumadaan dito na current is actually the base current so it will be minus uh, 470 so since these two are in series then we're going to add 470 kilo ohm plus 220 kilo ohm multiplied by the base current and the next would be the KVL so eto na plus minus we have minus 0 0.7 na BBE and then minus 1.5 kilo ohm IE and this is equal to 0 now we can always relate uh, yung ating IC at saka IE in terms of IB. Diba? So, we know that IC is equal to beta multiplied by IB. And we also know that IE is equal to beta plus 1 multiplied by IB. Okay? So, substituting these two in this, in this equation, so it will actually give us 30 minus 6.2 kilo ohm multiplied by beta is 100. So, 100 uh, IB minus, and we'll we are going to add this to 470 plus 220 will give us 7894690 kilo ohm multiplied by IB minus 0 0.7 minus 1.5 kilo ohm multiplied by 101 IB this is equal to 0 okay so yeah so we have uh, one equation one unknown solving for IB we have 30 minus 0 0.7 all over uh, 6.2K multiplied by 100 minus 600 or plus I should say 690 kilo ohm. Then all over uh, plus 1, 1.5K multiplied by 101. So there. Then calculate the value of the base current. Then, isang current, 
meron kang beta, then everything else is actually very easy. Okay? So, kung may question kayo, you can always ask uh, in our group chat. Okay? So, until next time, 